that have been following my series, we're in the chest singularity right now. And we're also without any gimmicks. This is real chess for real in real time. Nothing else. If you like chess, then this is for you because we don't do anything here except chess. Just there's nothing interesting here except chess. So let's go ahead and play a game, shall we? And see what we can do here because the chess singularity is when you get into the singularity you're unbeatable so let's see if we can do it i believe we're in the singularity right now so if we are in the singularity it means we're unbeatable so we'll check our hypothesis right now and we're playing this uh carol can defense it's a slightly modified version of how Carol Cans normally go. But as black, I always play that Carol Can defense. And there's not really much of a defense. It looks more like an attack for Christ's sake. Look at look at look look at look at how this is developing. This is incredible. Getting a lot of attacking possibilities here. Holy man, holy moly, look at this. How's he gonna how's he gonna protect against that? Okay, but you know what? I can force that guy out of there. I'm just gonna go for broke here. <clears throat> I'll just go ahead and take him. Should I or what can I do? I gotta move fast. And should I save that bishop or should I go over there for the king? What do I need that bishop for? Let me just go for the king. Check. That'll do it to you. Now what? <laughs> oh, man. I hope we're in the chess singularity. I really don't know if we are, but I'm going to... Try to get the king and the in the bishop on this black diagonal and see if that works. If it doesn't work, we'll always say it should have. That kind of like throws a little bit of uh, how would you say uh, on my fire. I don't know, we're just going for broke here. I mean, we're a piece down, but when you're a piece down, you just gotta go for broke. Thought he would do that. Now I got two pieces of his under attack. What's he going to do now? Ooh, he's going to go back there. I figured he might do that. Oh, boy. I don't know if this is a chess singularity or not. I think I'm going to have to reorganize over here. If I don't... Pull something off really fast, I'm going to be in big trouble. Really big trouble. <laughs> oh man, I don't have a lot of choice. I got to checkmate him. It's the only possibility. <laughs> it's the only possibility now. Got to checkmate this guy. If I could just checkmate, if I could get like a cool checkmate right now. Should not have done that, but I didn't have any other moves. Ah, crap. If he's smart, he'll just put me in check and trade off my queen. I should have moved my king over here and I would have had a chance for a mate. Oh, well. Better luck next time. 
Uh, hmm. I guess I don't have any choice like, to come down here. And I don't have any choice except, oh no. Ah, can you believe that? I'm gonna resign. Can I resign? I can't resign. It's not letting me resign. Okay, I, you know, the chess singularity comes in different forms. This next game could be the right moment, the right format. You just got to get your neurons in the right configuration is the key. Let's go for it. Let's go for it. We are no holds barred chess extravaganza. If you like chess, this is the place for you. If you don't like chess, then just get lost. I don't need you. You know, I'm just looking for people who like to play chess and love chess. Again, if you don't like chess, then it's not necessary that you're even here. We gotta move fast. Now that bishop can come over here with a kind of an attack. Now, 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 what's gonna come next? Gotta be thinking fast. This queen up to here will call, fill a lot of holes. I'm gonna do that. Hmm, I'm gonna have to move my king over to here or up to here. I'm gonna do like the weird thing. When you're in doubt in chess and you don't know what to do, do the weird thing. Usually it works good. He should move his pawn right up here now and kind of fuck me up. Oh, this is supposed to be a child channel. Give me a break. You know, I'm showing my students a lot of interesting checkmates here. If you guys are following me to learn, so you're in the right place because there was a number of pretty good mates that we just went through. Okay, now this is going to be the singularity, no gimmicks. I mean, if you've been following my series for the last few years, you'll know that it's usually like this. We are searching for the singularity. We don't always find it. But every once in a while, we hit the pocket. I'm thinking this might be the day. I think I think this might be it. I'm kind of thinking that we're in the singularity. Wow, give me a break. Should we do a sacrifice here? I can never figure out what to do in a situation like this. So if he takes there, I'm going to lose that pawn over there. I think I'll just lose the pawn. Why do we need a pawn? Pawns, pawns are not, they're not worthless, but they're not worth that much either. Should we attack again or something? I don't know. Should we complicate things or just move the king the hell out of there? This is a children's channel. They asked me if I wanted to have children watching, and I said, yeah, but I don't know. I guess I'm a little bit like Donald Trump, just like totally lawless. Oh, now what are we going to do? I think we can. I'm really not sure, but this looks like it pins the knight. I don't know if that <laughs> he attacks a pawn too. I wish, I just wish. I mean, it's not like we're losing this game. We're only a pawn down, for Christ's sake. It's no big deal. We're one pawn down, and like people are thinking we lost the game. Give me a break. 
We didn't lose this game. Like, look at that. It's a check, and... All right, we're in the singularity. There's no doubt about it. If you saw that, you were witness of a real chess singularity. And the chat is popping. The chat is popping right now. Uh, we've got a lot of lurkers. I'm um, looking at the lurker chat here. It's like they're saying, wow, amazing, awesome. I can't believe it. You're the best. Okay, let's try another one. That was great. Oh, I just love this chess. If, you, if you're into chess, then you're in the right place. So let's try it again. Here we go. Uh, wow. What kind of opening is this? Oh, the King's Gambit. All right. I, I, know, I know how to handle a King's Gambit. Um, castle, right? As long as he can't check you there with his queen. Uh, knight? Knight before bishops, they say, as they say. Buttress the center. <laughs> I, this is a children's channel. I have to watch my language. I understand. Um, the bishop can move back in this position. I've noticed this a million times. Like, it took me a long time to calculate this <laughs> when I was beginning. But with this pawn here and those advances, that with this, as long as you got the pawn there, you're okay. I like a pawn here. You know why I like a pawn right there? It blocks my king from every kind of diagonal. That pawn is like obsidian. And if you're if you have ever played Minecraft, you can't move obsidian, right? So you can't move that pawn because it's his, and it can't go forward, and it can't take anything unless I put something there. That's obsidian. Now let me see. Should I open this up? Yeah, I think so. He doesn't have a lot of choice. He either takes it and opens up this diagonal or doesn't take it and get screwed in some other way. So now it's a very important move. I want to advance this pawn up, so I move the bishop here to protect against that pawn. And also this bishop cuts down on this diagonal. If he doesn't make the right move, what well, else? Maybe his saving move. going to go down there because you'll see why in a second. Now, I got a couple of places I can bring him back. He's going to do best on this side because I want to keep, keep him trained on this king side, see? Now, if I move this pawn up, he's going to have troubles because I've got the bit, I've got the knight on him. He's going to have to open up his king position on this one. If he takes his bishop, no problem. I just take him there. This is good. Now I put him in check. He needs to take there. Ah, boy. And now I got to come out here and do great wonders. Um... Bishop is trying to do both things at the same time. He's trying to take this knight and take this rook. But what can I do? I think if I come out here, yeah, this looks great. But I can't save that bishop. I'm going to have to do go down here and then lift a rook. He's going to have to take the bishop because he's got problems. Because this bishop can come to here. You see, the problem was if the bishop comes to here, I want to take his rook, and then the bishop would have taken this knight, this pawn. Okay, now I'm going to lift the bishop. And I don't, I have the, the rook, I mean. And if he comes out with the with the rook, I bring my my bishop down here. That's going to help me a lot. I think. Hmm. 
I don't know what to do now. Maybe just fake him out. I don't know. He can bring his queen over. I think the best thing I can do is bring up some... I'm going to buttress some... Oh, he brought his queen over anyway. That was pretty good. Um, hmm. I like this rook here, so I'll bring this rook up to protect. Kind of figured this out now. Ah, boy, this is getting to be tough. Let me see if I can do something. Uh, the bishop. Oh, yeah. Didn't even see that. I got checkmate planned here, and if I move the bishop here, it can come over here. See? The bishop comes here and then here. Check. If he takes the bishop, oh, no, that's not me. What am I thinking about? But maybe I'll complicate the position here a little bit. He had his queen there. <laughs> queens, queens can move in every direction. I keep forgetting that. Okay, I'm going to move this pawn up and then bring this rook over. He maybe still have some chance. Did he bring that too soon? I can't go over in the corner. I'll get mated with the queen. I'm going to have to move over there. I don't know. Oh, he moved his queen. He moved his rook back pretty fast right there. Now he got his rook pinned. His best move is to bring this rook up here, but hopefully you won't see that. It's only rated 1790. Oh, I'm only rated below him, so I shouldn't say he's only rated 1790. Okay, well, that wins a queen, except I'm in trouble, aren't I? I got a queen now. I got a mighty queen. Gonna have to resign. I, you know, I thought I really thought we were in the chess singularity at that moment. I was feeling it, but sometimes your feelings are just a little bit mm, misguided, misled. But let's try again, shall we? Let's try a rematch. Look, I just clicked rematch there. If he wants to try it again, I'll grind his face into the. Dirt. Oh no, he's he, he's chicken. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try another thing here. Okay, here we go. If you guys like chess, you're in the right place because every once in a while we hit the singularity. You know, we're quite a bit into the singularity. If you've noticed my channel, singularity will be ours soon, very soon. Don't think we're going to have any problem now. We're going to hit the singularity. Oh, wow. I almost had a combination on there. Did you see that? If he takes there, I take there. The bishop comes there. And then what else? I don't know, but that was a great combination there. Uh, let's, let's try something else here. Okay, so this bishop needs to come here to get some action on that side. Now we're going to castle to aid our development. Oh no, what are we going to do now? Well, we'll just take, you know, this is obsidian, this pawn here. I love that pawn there. It's a great sacrifice. Um, okay, I'm going to get an attack here. How can I do that? Um, okay, first I'll buttress it. I can use that word. You know, I asked about the policy here. And they said, I wrote I wrote them an email and they said, uh, do you see the obsidian? There's no way you can move that thing. Now, if he moves the bishop here, I'm gonna bring my queen right up here. Yeah, you see, and he did that. So I'm gonna come right up here. My idea is to move this pawn. Well, I can't do that yet, I'm gonna have to buttress this pawn. Every time I say that word, I can just hear people complaining against my channel, but what can you do? 
Should I lift the rook now or slide him over? Sliding over seems really weak. I think I'm going to lift him. Lifting rooks is so incredibly strong. Oh, is he got a castle over there? He might. Oh, he can't because my queen is here. So let me threaten that ridiculous knight there. I don't like that knight. He's like a bad knight. Now this pawn can advance really easy. So I'm going to do it. You know, like he who hesitates is lost. And if you're lost at chess, you are truly lost. Ooh, now I'm going to... Ooh, this is nice, nice, nice. Give me a break. Can I check me in here? Let me see. Check, check, check. No, but he's still... i got to think this through. Christ, look, he's going to castle, and then this pawn's going to be strong. What can I do? Move this pawn, this this rook up. He takes, I take there. No, but then he'll castle that side. I got the obsidian there. I got this obsidian here, so I'm going to make an obsidian here too and see. Just see what happens. Got two blocks of obsidian in this game. Now we'd still have all our pieces. We're a couple of pawns down, but he's not castled yet. And I've got the two pieces of obsidian, so. I don't know what to do. I got two pieces of obsidian. I'm just going to come at him as strong as possible. He's going to castle, I think. Then I'll try to, I'll bring the, the queen here attacking this knight and then I'll come up here with the bishop. Hmm, I can't really come up there with the bishop, but I not to waste time, I'm going to do that. Because I can't come over there with the bishop because of his queen, but I can move this up. That would be kind of cool. He would have to move his queen. Then I can come up with the bishop. You see, because this pawn is pinned. He maybe doesn't see that. I'm going to do it. Why not? And then I can come up here. I don't know if this is going to work. But I think, yeah, I'll, get, I'll at least get an exchange for a bishop for a rook. This guy is named the Punisher. And so far he is exactly punishing me. Um, you know, punishing me in a lot of ways because he's making me see all kinds of dumb stuff. And I don't know if that's the best. What else can I do? At least I got an exchange. Um, Attack this pawn and that pawn, no. Yeah, why not? I'm going to attack this pawn and this pawn. I don't have, he's got three pieces defending this pawn. But if this knight moves, oh, his queen moved. I think he blundered there. I'm not sure about that, but let, let's see what happens here. He's got to take my queen or he's in trouble, and then I take his rook. I think he blundered there. I got to make sure that that pawn doesn't queen. Hmm. This is tough. Maybe I should bring my my king over. He can't bring this pawn up because I take this pawn. And if I bring this 
king. The king is a fighting is a fighting thing. Now I can almost checkmate him if I'm careful here. No, I can't. I think I'll bring this up. He can't advance the knight now because if he comes up here, I just take him. And now I block him out. These pawns are kind of like blocked now by my king. I'll come up here and really block him bad. A uh, minute 49 to 43, and he resigned. He's a pretty resourceful player, and I would say an honest and good player. I think, you know, it wouldn't be bad to say something to him. Denounced for using, what is that? Something, software? <laughs> okay. Yeah, these people are great. Okay, so denouncing you. So denouncing you for false accusation. Done. What a jerk. What a joker. You know, these people are rated 1,700, and they think just because I play a little bit good, I'm, I'm like, using software or something. I can't, can't believe these, these trolls. Okay, let's go for it. Denounced. You know, I've seen these people so many times. It's probably some MAGA idiot. You know, MAGA people are always like, hey, we lost the election, so that means you cheated because there isn't any way that that goddamn, uh, who, who was it, the senile guy? Um, Biden, yeah. There's no way Biden could have won without without some sort of help from from Venezuelan computer operatives or whatever they they want to say. Oh, Dominion! I'm glad that Dominion won their suit. By the way, yeah, this guy's gonna accuse me of cheating too. So, who cares? Um, we're doing okay here. That knight's going to have to go back. And... Let's see. Is this a sacrifice? Um, hmm. Oh, wait a second. I think that doesn't look too bad. We'll see how this works out. Because you see, I attacked this pawn and that pawn at the same time and this pawn's kind of important because it attacks his knight. Hmm. No what I'm gonna have to castle I think. I'm just checking before I do this to make sure my king my queen can get out of danger and it can. It's not like a poisoned pawn thing. I don't think although I did I noticed that that thing could come down there. Uh huh. It's the only place to go. And then the queen can escape down to here, no problem if he does something weird. Okay, if he takes that, I'll take him now. So I'm going to do this. He's got to take the rook, basically, or he can move back to there. You see, I thought he might do that, but. I get a rook and he got a, a knight. I don't know if I did the right thing there or not. We're, time will tell. Okay, here he comes. He's really coming down strong. Um, if I go here with the knight, with the rook, he comes here with the queen. The king comes here and the king can escape. The king can come over to this square. I think, I don't know, we'll see. 
I might have really screwed up here big time. I don't know. I think I'm going to lose a rook here. But maybe that's okay. I'll bring the king up into there. Kind of like almost losing this game in a way, but... I'm going to try something really tricky. Attack his queen. His queen's got to go back down to here. I'm going to bring my knight over here. Oh, wait a second. He did something really weird there. Now I got his... Should I bring my king back here? Probably. Why advance him? If I don't have to. The king is normally safer on his own side. <laughs> it's kind of like a weird rule, I suppose you could say. He doesn't like to take walks. 249 to 302. Well, I got my activity feed. Narcissus followed me. That's pretty cool. Um, okay, we're going to attack his queen again. <sighs> Why not? And we're attacking his knight at the same time. We'll attack his queen again. Now his queen is going to have trouble. I think I got more pieces than him now. Not sure about that, but... If he brings his rook here, I'm just going to trade off his rook. Okay, where is his queen going? I don't think it's going anywhere. I'm going to attack. What should I do? Something smart here. I don't know. Bring my my thing down there. I don't see where he can attack my king. He's going to take this pawn. This is crazy. I don't know what I'm doing. Probably going to lose this game because of the whole situation where I'm just kind of like in the doldrums right now. That was a good move because he was going to take here. Now that will attack his queen and his bishop at the same time. Let's see what he does. I moved the, the knight out here attacking his... Oh, and his queen is gone. Okay. I want to I want to get a good move right here. There. Okay, well, I think we're in the the I think we are in the singularity now. You saw how it happened. You saw an innocent person accused of cheating somehow. But that's, that's the reaction you get. When you are in the singularity, you are playing excellent chess and people are going to accuse you like crazy because when you're in the singularity, you're just going to advance, 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 and there's no stopping you. So without any gimmicks, without any sort of exaggerations or anything, this was just real chess in real time for you, really, and we'll see you soon. See you another time, very, very soon. Okay, have a good one. I'm going to look here in the producer here, how to sign off. For those of you who haven't done this, you just click here, end stream. See you next time. End stream.